Hi everyone, I'm Mary with Mary Greeley News. Thank you for joining me this evening. Well, Puerto Rico had a magnitude 4.2 earthquake, which 64 people reported feeling. Yeah, there's been a lot of earthquakes there in that region. It's along the Muertos Trough, also along the Puerto Rican Trough, which is being crushed in between uh, the two. We got Puerto Rico. I've covered this area many times. It's long past due for a major earthquake, and I think this is an indication of the pressure building. In the last week alone on the map, and I'll pull this over here, there's been over 369 earthquakes. Since this 4.2 earthquake, there's been a 2.5, a 2.8, and prior to that, there was a 3.1, a 3.2, Ah, uh, what else we got? And these are all today. Look at them all. Yeah, quite a few, wouldn't you say? Looks like the uh, threes are the largest today, um, besides the 4.2. This earthquake was felt all across the island. Yeah, and I've talked about if and whenever that large earthquake that's waiting to come happens you'll have to find a structure to evacuate straight up and you'll have the areas along the beaches along the coast that will turn to quicksand and depending on the size of the earthquake it might last anywhere from three to six minutes not much would be be remain standing after a three to six minute of shaking and if past history repeats itself you could have a tsunami up to about 33 feet in height this whole area of the Caribbean is slowly being pushed down being crushed by the North American plate the Cocos plate you know I've talked about the Mona Passage and I've talked about the deepest trough in this area which is near the Cayman Islands Jamaica you know what happened in the 1700s but if I zoom out here on USGS in the last week alone on this map, there's been 442 earthquakes in the last seven days. I hope people there are prepared the best they can. Yeah, it's going to be a rough year coming in 2020, I think. So what are your thoughts? Put your comments down below. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for your support. Have a very merry, happy new year. And please don't drink and drive. And I'll talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.